Question of the Week from the Naked Scientists. Hi, I'm Khalil Thurloway, and welcome to Question of the Week. This week, we're bridging the gap between us and the rest of the animal kingdom to find an answer to this question tweeted at us by Bar Royale. Is attraction for the same sex found in animals too? There are lots of behaviours that we sometimes think of as exclusively human, but in many cases, upon investigation, we find out we're not so different from our animal cousins. To see if this is the case here, I heard from Dr. Paul Vasey from the University of Lethbridge in Canada. Same-sex sexual behaviour, such as courtship, mounting and pair bonding, has been documented in well over 100 species worldwide. Same-sex sexual preferences in animals are harder to document conclusively because this requires demonstrating that an individual chooses a same-sex sexual partner even though opposite sex mates are both available and willing. Despite the fact that such data can be difficult to collect, preferences for sexual partners of the same sex have been documented in a number of animal species, most notably Japanese monkeys. In that particular primate species, females in certain populations routinely choose female sexual partners despite the fact that motivated male mates are available. In most species, individuals that engage in same-sex sexual behavior also engage in sex with opposite sex mates. So overall, they exhibit a bisexual pattern of sexual orientation. In domestic sheep, however, about 6 to 10% of males only court other males and engage in same-sex sexual behavior exclusively, never interacting sexually with females. Consequently, scientists talk about these rams as being homosexual with respect to their sexual orientation. This is higher than many estimates of homosexuality in the human population. Here in the UK, for example, the Office for National Statistics reported in 2011 that roughly 1.5% of adults describe themselves as gay or lesbian. Estimates vary, however, and mostly rely on self-reported survey data, which can result in inaccuracies. But why do animals exhibit homosexual behaviour in the first place? It certainly won't accomplish the most obvious purpose of mating, which is to produce offspring. In many instances, Animals use same-sex sexual behavior to facilitate adaptive social goals. For example, bonobos, or pygmy chimpanzees, use same-sex genital rubbing to reduce tension associated with food sharing, to form alliances, and to reconcile conflicts. However, in some species like Japanese monkeys, individuals engage in same-sex sexual interactions simply because they're sexually gratifying and not because they serve any sort of social function. Whether it's to enhance their social position, improve group cohesion, or simply because they enjoy it, there are many natural examples of non-human animals exhibiting homosexual and bisexual behaviour. There is, however, no evidence of animals being ostracised for this, so homophobia appears to be a uniquely human trait. Food for thought, right? Next week, we'll be getting hands-on with this question from Hannah. I've heard that London cab drivers get bigger parts of their brain from having to know where all the roads are, and I'm wondering if the bit of my brain that makes my right thumb type text messages on my phone might also be changing. What do you think? If you think you know the answer, you can email chris at nakedscientists.com, find us on Facebook or Twitter, or join the discussion in our forum at thenakedscientists.com slash forum. Question of the Week is part of the Naked Scientists podcast and supported by the Wellcome Trust and UK Fast. Look us up online at nakedscientists.com. Thank you.